Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome to Sunday reading. I hope you listen to the weekly reading uh, that I did uh, for this coming week. Look at this. Action, this card. I just saw this card is awesome. Look at the look at the uh, the card. Look at the um, like the sky. Look, it's like you go in. You just don't know where you go, and you need to step up and keep going. Sometimes we're so afraid because we're looking at the future. We don't know what the future gonna be. But if you take one step at a time, the 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 road become more and more clearer and. Then when you reach the destiny, look, things open up, open up for you. I usually leave the card to the end, but it's so funny that uh, that uh, I, I did it first. Take action. The journey to find your lost self begins with one step. Isn't that something? It is beautiful. I think we all are at one step in our life. And we really need to move on, but we're scared. There is a fear. What is it we need to do? How we need to change? And, you know, look at this. I want you to see this. And I'm glad sometimes that the camera, I hope you don't mind it. You know, I uh, um, look at this. Look, some of you already stepped out. You already got out. Some of you already, but look how you stand in straight. You're not even moving. Your feet together, you stand in straight, you look in, you have something in your hand. It's like, should I move? What can I find over here? Should I really move? But your head, look at this, you're standing up, the road is good just your head you're too much in your head because you're too much in your head there is too much darkness that you cannot see the road right look at that you let go of that already and you moved on so when i hold the cup and turn it sometimes i ruin the outside this is why i like to uh do this first wow let me see let's do this for for sunday this is our Sunday cup. Um, look at this. You have, you stand in here. Okay. This is really, look, there is a man right here. And he has two women in his hand. One of them was long hair. Do you see that? And the other one is, is, um, um, on his other side but at the same time this other person walking away and the woman that is on the other side like look this is one this is the I don't know what is going on in here it could be a family thing it could be a family feud it could be you know a father mother and two kids and maybe the two kids are fighting and uh, uh, parents holding them by their neck. You know, it's like they're not taking the crap. Maybe this is a week where you connect with your siblings, where you um, get more of a, of a, it's like maybe there is separation and all of a sudden you let go of whatever happened and you're really trying to get closer uh, and connect again or it could be a mother and a father and they're holding the two two people two kids maybe in their hands trying to get them together um, look at this person in here it's like the count remember sesame street the count he is looking he's counting it's like what's next what's next well i have to show you because you know, there is manifestation here. See the butterfly behind them? There is a manifestation. There is a, 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 something in you happening. There is magic. Magic is, what is magic? It's like the, the, the earth, the sky gonna rain money over your head? No, 
Magic is when you get to that state of mind and body, physically, emotionally, mentally, that you are in peace. You're not resisting somebody else. You're not fighting with somebody else. You're not disliking somebody else. Okay? And that's it. And when that happened, look at this person, turn their back and they're gone. They're leaving. They're leaving. So whoever was involved in here, probably you guys had to let go because you see this tooth in here. So whatever going on with your in your life, whoever you are arguing with, maybe people trying to get you two together, or maybe it's brother and sister, maybe uh, it's a relationship and two people getting involved. My friends, you cannot, you cannot just have anybody get involved. It is not the right thing to do. Not everybody understand. You have to get somebody wise, somebody deep, somebody worked on themselves, somebody been through hell back and forth and, and worked so hard on themselves to understand how spiritually, uh, energetically, mentally, physically, everything work out. What hold you in your place and what let you go, see? And, and, and here, and here, like this person, you see this other person turned their back. And probably the person that's causing the problem is this woman. Maybe this is not a man with the hair tied in the back. Who knows? But the important part, the magic come in your mind. It's your mind, the way you think. Okay? And here you're standing up, but you look at you. You are like a lizard. I wonder what is a lizard? If you know what's a lizard, look the lizard up. And, you know, sometimes I wish I, I look at those cups ahead of time, but I don't like to because I already put in mind what I'm going to speak. I don't like to. I like to just get led, see things and just get led with it. And and this is it. This is the, the lizard. Look at the face. Oh, I don't know. Maybe you need to go to Geico. <laughs> no, I'm joking. <laughs> But look at this. Somebody is laying down. Somebody is sick. They're not dead. They're not dead. They're sick. Look at the head up. Uh, so they're trying to to um, to get back to life. And uh, there is a kite in here. And this kite, it is, it's a new seat. It's a new, it's something. It's a changing, something moving from one state to another. It's like there is a, a change in your life. There is a change. There is something that you, the sickness that, that you fell or the sickness or whatever it is, it's like, Cut this peacock. It's stuff that you dream of that you want to be and you fight and all your life and boom, you feel you just laid back. You just can't fight no more. You can't resist no more. You can't really complain no more. You cannot keep pointing fingers no more. That said, you're done. You're done. Something in you happened. This person right here stood up. This is the head. And it's, it's wearing a long robe. And it's a blessing in disguise. It's like this person get up. They looked at themselves. Maybe they got a, a near-death experience. They looked at themselves and it's like, why I'm doing all this to me? All of a sudden, their vision is clear. They start to see differently. And it's like, oh, I don't want a part of that. I want what I see here. I want the peace. I want the quiet. I want good feelings. I want, I want love, right? This is awesome. This is beautiful. Sunday cup is really beautiful. There is a lot in here, and, but you know, I can't really, it, it, it's supposed to be the daily reading, supposed to be very simple. You have an ant, that means that tell me you need to really think about the future and to save your some stuff, so to save money, that to be so uh, um, spending and not thinking about the future because something coming up, <clears throat> I'm sorry. <clears throat> I need a cup of water and I didn't bring it. The future is beautiful. The future is beautiful. Look at this here. It said Allah. 
Allah is God in Arabic. I grew up praying to Allah till I spoke English. And then I learned to pray to God. <laughs> so anyway, it's the same thing, my friends. You know, don't follow preachers that tell you Allah is something bad. Allah and God and energy and the divine and, and, and everything is the same. They are the same. No, the American, the English language came later. Arabic language was first. So Allah, that tell me you need to, you need to walk up. This is this is this is the journey. This is take action, and look, I love it. I love it because that makes sense. Look, Allah is here, okay, and this is in Arabic written, okay. But look at you. Look, one foot here, one foot there. You're climbing up. You're climbing up. But in God willing, in God, in having faith in God, that God is with you, and doing what is right, and dreaming what is right. Whatever you're dreaming of, it has to be good for you and others. You cannot harm others to get to where you want. You have to have God in your life. You have to have Allah in your life. Okay? Allah Kabir, God is mighty and he loves all of us no matter where we come from. So I want to wish you all a beautiful journey, a beautiful journey, because next week we're going to end up in July. I'm like, wow, how did this all happen? My friends, please like and subscribe. I would really appreciate that. You know, if, if this speak to you, Subscribe, hit the, the, the bell button so anytime I do a reading, you can get it. Thank you.